Hi, and welcome to another FabFitFun Friday. I'm going to have a mystery bundle battle against myself. So, if you want to see what I got, stay tuned. Hi, and welcome to our channel. My name is Tracy. Um, Chloe's not with me, but Bandit's sitting next to me, and he's been a very barky boy tonight, so who knows what could happen. But if you're new, welcome. Thanks so much for checking us out. We do all kinds of unboxings, unbaggings, get ready with me's, collaborations, all kinds of fun stuff. So if you're into that kind of thing, please consider hitting the subscribe button. And if you're returning, thank you so much for being a part of our YouTube family. See, there's my Bandy boy. And um, in the background, I don't know if you can see this, it's a sloth. So Stacy, if you're watching Dollar Tree, if you haven't already seen it. Um, all right. So usually I do Saturday um, morning FabFitFun mystery bundle battles with my friend Monique over at Monique's Unique Critique. She is taking a little pause for now. Um, you'll see her web, her, um, her page now just says pause on it. So, um, you know, she's just needing to take a little bit of a break right now. It's got a lot going on. I know some of you have reached out to me to ask how she's doing. And, you know, I have reached out to her and she just needs a little bit of a break right now. So, um, you know, our lives get busy, things happen, and she just needs to focus on, on that right now. But I'm hoping that she'll be back soon and we'll be right back up to our usual antics with battles. But for now, I've got all these battles, so I'm going to battle myself. You guys will get to vote. And two weeks after the date that I post this, um, I will send a small little uh, mystery bundle out to one of you um, just for voting. Okay, so I have two bundles to share with you. One is 2204 MYS029. Two of the items in here I did receive in a um, mystery bundle last from the last round that I had. So at least I didn't have to look up two of the items. I did, because the bags are clear, I did go through and just look up everything so I could have some prices for you and tell you where I got the prices from because sometimes things are um, no longer in stock so I have to find like a Poshmark price or something like that. All right, so this has that black silky noir um, scrunchie, and this is $15. And again, we have this headband that I really couldn't place. I'm really not sure. I think it's a yoga headband. It does have like a little um, slit in the back to put a ponytail through, and it does have like this white material on the inside which I'm guessing is for sweat so I did find a company that sells things that are very similar to this I couldn't find this exact pattern but um, it could be just an old pattern of theirs as well and so these were uh, the ones that what I think it is is by Aruna um, it would be for yoga and it was a $15 value next by Earth Harbor we have the Mermaid Milk Nutrient Glow Moisturizer. I have used this. It's a wonderful moisturizer. I've only found one product that I didn't prefer from this company. So here's how it looks. And it's a lovely moisturizer. This retails for $42. And then last is this Ori Ageless Aloe Moisture Wash by Zents. All right, so here's how it looks. This here, it's a body cleanser, right? Body, I think it's body. I actually didn't even check that out online, what it was for, but I was guessing it was for body. Um, it has bay laurel, orris, lang lang, clove, and black pepper for use as a hydrating and anti-aging hand and body wash, shave gel, and bubble bath. It has organic shea aloe, organic lotus flower, and organic fruit extracts, such as lemon and orange, to help skin look brighter. Now, it did say on the website, as far as age, it said 65 and over. Now, if I'm, if I'm, I'm old, but I'm not that old. Um, it definitely is a little 
muskier than I would like, um, but we'll still give it a try here. And um, 40, what was this, 42? $42, $42 for a hand wash. Oh my goodness. Makes it feel like when I go to Bath Body Works, it's a steal. So in number one, we have the hand wash, hand and body wash, the face cream, the yoga headband, and the scrunchie. Bag number two. This is 2204 MYS 030. And we have these Deco Miami Hidden Hill nail stickers. Super pretty. This is a $10 value. It's got some real pretty flowers and butterflies, lemons. Oh, pretty. By Ilmasco, we have a powder eyeshadow. This is a single. These retail for $22, although at the time of filming, they are on sale for $11, but we're going to go with the price that you would normally pay for them. I always do that because you never know what, you know, whether you'd catch it on sale or not, but that is a lovely, lovely color. Very pretty. Okay, now next, sometimes FabFitFun just overloads me with things. I got two pairs of sunglasses in the same bundle. I thought that was a little weird, but okay. So the first is the Circus by Sam Edelman line, which means you know that they were expensive. They probably were selling these in Neiman Marcus. They are no longer, um, they no longer have the sunglasses, so I could only find um, like a price on thread up for $27.99. Although I think you could find these in Poshmark and whatnot. My guess is that these probably were about double that in price. So these were probably 60. I mean, they could have been more They're Sam Edelman. I mean, goodness knows these could have gone for $150 for all I know, but I couldn't even find any recent ones. All right, you know these are right up my alley. Love these. You know I love sunnies. And they're sparkly. Look at that. The other day my calendar said at work, I have a, every day it's something sassy. And it said, um, I went to the dentist and he told me I needed a crown. And I said, I know, right? But I gave it to a friend of mine who's even more extra than me. And then by Privé Review, these are their Commando glasses. They always come in these nice cases. There is a little cleaner. This is $40 on their website. Now this is one style that is not my favorite. All right, what do you guys think? Are they me? Um, but that being said, my daughter has a pair that I gave her like this, probably from another fab. They might even be the same brand, I'm not sure. Um, anyway, I have um, a pink cover-up that I wear to the pool in the summer, and I have like a pink hat that goes with it. I think I got them both from Oceanista and they look really cute with these rose gold glasses. Again, she has some just like it. These are very, um, they're not Polaroids, but boy, they are very, very reflective. Like, yeah, that's going to work really nicely in the summer. All right. So in bundle number two, we have the Commando sunglasses, the sparkly Sam Edelman glasses, the eyeshadow and the nail decoration. So this is kind of like a summary feel kind of bundle. Um, the, the entire bundle with the glasses being the Sam Edelman glasses being at $27 was $99. Now my, again, my guess is that these probably originally retailed for at least double that, if not more. So probably what this would have been 
would have been somewhere more around 150 to 160 dollars depending upon how much these glasses really were and again they could have been even so much more because sam edelman very very expensive brand so it wouldn't surprise me if these retailed even above 60 dollars all right well let me know which bundle you preferred which bundle you would have been happier to receive or maybe none who knows maybe you're not a sunglass person and you know maybe you're not a whatever scrunchy person so i will have my rules down below um and it's basically you know you have to be subscribed and uh, you have to hit the like button and you have to have an address within the united states that i can um mail you out something to um because i'm probably going to send you like beauty products which means that you know you can't send those internationally um there's even things you know you can't send it to canada so i don't want your um, your package being held up at customs. Um, everything will be down below, be 18 or over. YouTube and FabFitFun don't sponsor this. They're not involved in it at all. It's just a little something from me to you. All right, well, thank you so much, and hopefully I'll see you soon.